Well, Steve Herman is White House Bureau Chief for Voice of America News, and he joins us now from Washington. Steve, just wondering about the timing of the First Lady's comments. Um, is that designed to sway the president? Was the president's uh, administration aware that the First Lady would make this statement? I, I doubt that there was um, a little doubt that the West Wing was aware of what the East Wing was doing, uh, especially on a Sunday. Essentially, how this developed is when reporter, reporters made uh, inquiries uh, uh, to the office of the First Lady, uh, they then were delivered this response. This wasn't uh, something that the First Lady tweeted out or that they just uh, unilaterally issued a statement. And the way that they're uh, spinning this is we're just responding to, uh, to a reporter's inquiry about it. But uh, look, everybody else in this country is weighing in on this controversial issue. So it would have been pretty difficult uh, for the First Lady and her office to stay silent. Uh, but they're really playing it both ways because if you look at the language of that statement, uh, for the um, president's uh, most uh, vociferous detractors, they'll say that the first lady is reinforcing this lie, that this is uh, something that the Democrats have initiated, that this is a political thing uh, because the president can snap his fingers and uh, reverse this uh, uh, immediately. And then uh, there are those who will point uh, to this uh, statement uh, that uh, we that there should be a, a heart uh, in this immigration approach and, and, and see that there are some cracks uh, uh, between the president and first lady. But uh, I, I think what we also need to point out on this is that the president himself on Friday said, quote, I hate the children being taken away. But he, of course, uh, was blaming uh, this all on Democrats and that they need to work with Republicans to change the law. What are the chances, Steve, of comprehensive immigration reform, the so-called Democrats and Republicans coming together across the aisle, as the First Lady said in that statement? Well, I think there's a tremendous pressure, uh, especially on uh, some of the Republicans uh, who are looking at uh, uh, these uh, pictures every day and uh, those who are going to be facing uh, close elections in November uh, worry that if this stays in the headline, this could damage them. So I think there is a uh, on the Republican side, and we've had a few Republican senators weigh in and, and say that this is terrible and that the president can change it and something needs to be done. The president will be meeting with some uh, lawmakers on Monday in the White House. And uh, we can expect uh, perhaps uh, it, within a few days that there will be some legislative movement. Thank you very much. That's Steve Herman, White House Bureau Chief for Voice of America in Washington.